Today in this 2006 Ford Taurus, we're going to install part number 18002 from Toready. This is a four pole flat car end, 60 inches long with the wire taps. Our install is going to begin on the inside of a trunk and we'll get to the wiring harness which is located on the passenger side of the vehicle behind the carpeting. Alright, this is our main wire harness. So we'll just peel away the tape so we can get to the wires. And you can double check just to make sure if it goes to this tail light and also over to the opposite tail light. What we want to do first is make a ground so we have something for our tester to work off of. There's not really a body ground in there. Ground screw into the body here. Okay, we'll start testing our wires. First we'll check the running light circuit. Okay. We'll go ahead and turn it off to verify that's the right one. Okay, so no more signal. So that means that's a running light circuit. And that's a brown wire, so we can go ahead and just make our first connection to that. So we'll do is use our wire tap here, also known as a scotch lock. And all it does is just snaps over one wire, and then the other wire slips in right next to it. And that metal piece in the middle actually cuts through the, the plastic and makes a connection between the two. Squeeze in a pair of pliers, and that's it. And we'll do the left turn signal. All right, looks like the left turn is green with a red stripe. So we'll connect our yellow wire for left turn to the wire we tested. This time. Okay, now we'll move on to the right turn signal. Okay, so it looks like orange with a blue stripe. So we'll connect up our green wire to that. And again, we'll double check our connections. Green for right turn. All right, let's do the left turn. Okay, and we're all good on that part. So all I go down. Let's make a ground. And we'll use a simple ring terminal. We we'll strip back our wire, and we'll just redo our ground. The four pole will get stored inside the trunk area when it's not in use. And when you do need to use it, just pull it out and shut the lid on it. This door seal right here actually is thick enough where it won't hurt the wire. Just stay away from the latch and you'll be fine. Pull out what you need to get down to your trailer. All right, and with that, that finishes our install. Part number 18002 from Toe Ready.